and gentlemen, welcome to Mega Burn, the Power Racing Series. <laughs> Brought to you by Liquid Ranch. How are you doing, Detroit? Yeah. I can't hear you. How are you doing, Detroit? Yeah. That's what I like to hear. This is the Power Racing Series. We take your kids' toys that you throw out because your kids drove them for a summer or two, and then they outgrew them, and then you sell them on Craigslist for about 20 bucks. We take them, we make them bigger, faster, stronger, so much better than before. We make them into lean, mean racing machines. We make them the most awesomest things that you have ever seen. This is the Power Racing Series for just $500. That's right, for the price of a new power wheel, we make you take your old ones and make them into racing machines for adults. That's right, nothing but adults. And we race for points. That's right, just imaginary points. What do you need? That go towards a championship because this is a real racing series. But we race from coast to coast. We started in San Francisco and we're slowly moving our way east across the country where we will have our final race in New York for the championship. And right now there are a couple of teams that are way out in front for the championship vying for that. We have Fubar. Oh, sorry, Vindy. We have Nimby from Oakland, California. We also have Cartastrophe from Grays Lake, Illinois. Phantom Power Racing Series from Chicago, Illinois. Lotusaurus Rex from Milwaukee. Chibi Miku Van from MIT. These cars are the fastest cars out there, and they're all vying for the championship. But right now, they are not the ones out here today because these cars are the slow ones. That's right, these cars are the ones that aren't doing so great. They are the boxy cars. And what's moxy you say? Moxy is you guys. That's right, you. Your votes. Your votes are moxy. Can I see the moxy board? Who's got the moxy board? There you go, Reese, the guy on the top hat, who's got the moxy board. He's gonna be going around right now, and I want everybody to vote for their favorite car out there. Reese, go, go, go through the crowd there, buddy. Go. Reese? There you go. Walk around the car, buddy. Oh. Merry Christmas, Patrick. We're going to go through the crowd, and everyone's going to vote for their favorite team. Each team has a label and a button. You can vote for as many teams and as often as you like. We call it Chicago-style voting. You can vote for whoever you want, whether they go fast or slow or do something awesome. This is your vote. This is what you... This is all you, because your votes count to race points, and they matter. But all these teams are going to be racing for Moxie, because there are nine other cars that are a little bit faster than these guys. And they're going to be racing for race points, but these guys are racing for Moxie points. That's right. Oh, yeah. That is their redeeming factor, is to get a little bit of Moxie and a little bit of boost in their points. Yeah, that's because right. they haven't been doing so well today. But your uh, Moxie points can change that. Isn't that right, Patrick? Those votes right. to that board, that will help these teams out. And after this race, we are going to see our fast nine, our top nine cars, battle it out in a 30-lap melee. But right now, we're going to do a 30-lap moxie challenge, where the winner is whoever gets the most moxie vo votes, as many as you can press. So vote early and often. Um, right now, I got a pretty interesting grid here. Due to the qualifying, we actually have a quick car here. You might be the quickest one here. You, this win might be honorary for you, but you also have to get through this crowd. Do you think you'll be able to do it? I'll do what I can. This, this car has a nice rack and steering, so I can always wiggle pretty, pretty well. With this and you put it together yourself. Um, my team helped me, Milwaukee Maker State. Sure did help a lot, but this was my first build. All right. Her first build, ladies and gentlemen. And she's here, she's competing this season. Um, right now, we have uh, car 412. It's been desecrated by uh, the Aristocrats. It's been attacked by all of Batman's enemies. Um, are you guys ready to go? Where's your helmets? Where's your racing clothes? We're pretty close. It's, you know, it's there. It, it's there. It's present. I see it. Yeah. Yeah. Are we good to go? All right. All right. Just, you know, whatever. That's fine. It's just a race going on. That's all right. All right, Iron Rose, um, this is a good shot for you to get on a podium and get as many moxie points as you can. Do you think you can pull that off? I don't know. I just got confused with the dinosaur. Thompson always right behind her. This, this inter-team rivalry seems to get more and more intense by day, mostly from bubbles. There's a lot of bubble attacks. Um, 
Oh, a little bit feisty. We haven't gotten started yet. Careful. The dinosaur and, and, and steampunk anger. It's all steam powered, right? They're gonna watch where the, the Grim Reaper will get them. Oh the yeah. Aggressiveness. Well, I, I'm trying to think like if they're both teammates and yet both of them want to ruin each other's bumpers. <laughs> but speaking of which, we have the Grim Reaper here who is gonna make sure everyone keeps clean and doesn't get too messy out there. The Grim only speaks with penalties. He might tell a driver to pull over and give you all a high five. He might tell him to do push-ups. He might find, tell him to find a needle in our growing haystack over there. It doesn't matter. It's up to him and all sales are final with the Grim Reaper. You do not want him against you. But right now, track marshals, can I get a thumbs up for you? Track marshals, are we good to go? Thumbs up from all of our track marshals. We are looking good. Drivers, are you ready to go? Thumbs up for the drivers. Now, most importantly, fans, are you ready to see this Moxie round for 30 laps? And get that Moxie boy vote in. Vote your Moxie points. That is giving them race points for the championship. Patrick, I'm turning it over to you. I'm going to need one cotton down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And it is the slow start of our slow cars. They are slow cars, but they're having an amazing battle into the first turn. Fubar with 412's uh, Batmobile, the Inventicart, and Lucky 15 all are right next to each other. While Lotusaurus Rex, ladies and gentlemen, oh, this says Rex is going first. Four left over race points. Batmobile's having a look, and fighting with Nerf. They are fighting with Nerf versus Bubbles. And the tiny car, and popping wheelies. From all hands active. Matilda, also in my Lotusaurus Rex, wanting your Moxie votes. Want all of your votes. She's pulling away. Right now, Fubo Labs attacking Iron Rose while Lucky 13 also attacking. These four cars are going to battle out all the way to the end. Patrick, what's that I hear in the distance? I do, I hear something. Oh, oh, is that, is that murder banana? I can't believe it, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, I believe it is. I'm going to Detroit. Omni Core Detroit is crashing your party, ladies and gentlemen. He's crashing the party with the murder banana. He's not even on the Moxie board, but he's here for your love. High five with the leader right now. The dead people moving. That is a lot of speakers for a vehicle, Patrick. And right now, these five cars have been back and forth. Meanwhile, Omni Core Detroit putting laps down. Murder Banana is driven by DJ Party Crasher. DJ Party Crasher, known as Brandon Richards from Omnicore Detroit, a great happy space in your very own hometown. Meanwhile, right now, we have a battle here. All of these cars, they're slowly working their way through. We high fives to everyone now. There are so many high fives being distributed on trap. I can't keep track of them. Right now, Lucky 13 from Detroit is in second place, followed by Fubar Labs from New Jersey in third, which is right there. Fubar's got to do something for Moxie, because he certainly isn't going to get any race points here. Oh, uh, looks like we're having Omni Cross oh, driving over the record. <laughs> oh, Smith Gun going away. Meanwhile, if I can't recall correctly, Milwaukee Makerspace and Lucky 13 are one and two right now. Yes, they are, with Fubar Labs in third. This is going to get interesting. In the middle of the Moxie Challenge, we have, I think, a race breaking out. Lotusaurus Rex, Lucky 13, first and second place, ladies and gentlemen. Lucky 13 going, ooh, you are falling down the back. On the outside, amazing pass from Lucky 13. From Detroit. Oh, 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 oh. He's, he re-ended the iron. Oh, he re-ended the iron. Oh, getting a little wrapped up there. Watch out for the grim. Oh, they're having fun out there, ladies and gentlemen. First and second place, they're right on top of each other. Even third and fourth with Fubar and Iron Rose. 
Uh, there's actually a race going on in this moxie round. The guys are supposed to be doing cool things, but they're still yeah. fucking playing, so race is going to be moxie, baby. Moxie, moxie. Who would expect a race would break out on a racetrack of all places? <laughs> We're only 10 laps in, 20 to go. It's the longest 10 laps I've ever seen. <laughs> If anyone wants to make a break for uh, a beverage or a tasty treat, that was a good time. Oh, it looks like Matilda from All Hands Active collecting into the tire wall, thinking they're getting back on their way. Iron Rose looking for more Moxie points. I think she's run out of the bubbles. Yeah, I think she doesn't have much bubbles left. The Milwaukee cars who have been locked stuff with each other. Oh, and All Hands Active standing up for some Moxie! Surf in their car. Yeah, the only car you can surf on in the middle of the race. That's right, all hands active. Call. Oh! That's the caution. Ladies and gentlemen, all hands active until the round of applause. They are surfing. They got bit by the tire sharks. Oh, and the leader! Meanwhile, in the middle of that, the leader, Lucky 13, is pulling over to the inside. Oh, no! Something must be broken. Oh, the turning linkage. He lost his steering. Unbelievable. Now going straight. Motosaurus Rex is about to take the lead. From the Milwaukee Makers race. Motosaurus Rex is in the lead now. Lotus so Rex followed by Fubar now in second. Batmobile now third and Lucky 13 has now fallen to fourth. Oh, that is a shame. They are leading with a dramatic first place overtake. Well, it's all Iron Rose passing and Lucky 13 has fallen to fifth. And Matilda on three wheels as usual. They're going to have to get a lot more moxie if they want to make up for that. Oh my, yes, that's true, but Milwaukee Makerspace, Lotosaurus Rex must be getting a Moxie Clinic right now. She's running a fantastic race, keeping out of trouble. Also, Fubar Labs, big green car out there, also doing a great job. All hands active, Matilda, still surfing, despite that fill. And the event card is back out. We're seeing some tunes back there still for Brandon. Who's in the pits? Trying to see if we can mix that race up. Right now, it looks like she's pulling away. There might not be that many laps left for them. Oh, I'm not sure if that is some noise from the sprocket of All Hands Active. It sounds a lot noisier than before. And Lucky 13 is coming back underway. No! no! Can he gain it back? We still have time in this race, Patrick. Matilda's hot on his tails. He can overtake the Avenicar and Iron Rose if he gets a good pace going. Maybe he doesn't crash again. I think the Avenicar is running low on batteries. Yeah, he's nodding. Yeah, his batteries are running low. Meanwhile, three wide pass. Both of them on the inside of each other. They keep it together. Very clean pass. Oh, oh no. And there is no more juice in the event cart. Oh, that is a shame. They gotta get it cleared off the track. Thankfully, these cars are slow enough that they have enough time to do it. These Moxie cars, these cars were built not for speed, but for real entertainment. All out of juice for the event cart. But only 10 laps to go for Milwaukee Makerspace, which is in the lead right now. Well, Lucky 13 is slowly but surely. No, they just collided with the leader behind him colliding as well. Oh no, a pile up in the back. That is a caution. And we're back on the green. It looks like the Grim has made a decision with Iron Rose, it looks like. Like I said, all sales are final with the Grim. We can't stop him. And Lucky 13 is still telling if Lucky 13 to pull into the center. No, he's pulling into the pits. 
Yeah, lucky for two, pulling in the pits, going around. I'm not sure what's up with that. Meanwhile, Mil uh, Lotus Source Rex is still in the lead, and Fubar Labs is now caught up with them. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Fubar Labs um, is oh, now coming to the lead. Lucky 13, we're going to do the Macarena for that race in the middle here. Oh, I, don't, I don't think that was the Macarena. I think it was... I, I, was, I don't know what that was. I mean, it's been a long time since I've done the Macarena, so maybe that was fun. Oh, hello there, look! Yeah, so they're in bunch of snarks at that all the Meanwhile, Fubar Labs is is catching up with Vodasaurus Rex. This race is an area, which is seven laps to go. First place, Fubar Labs second place. Lucky 13 making up for the ground. Ooh, a very close pass. But it worked, it went through. Lucky 13 is still in good place. And we're winding down. I'm starting to notice that uh, unique power racing smell. Yeah, I smell, uh, that's, I don't know if you can smell it, but there's a slight tinge of uh, motor burning. Yeah, already. That is definitely winding down. Someone's, someone's motor windings are slowly melting, and someone's motor is slowly turning themselves into a hump of copper. I would like the track marshals to know that they should watch out for a potential magic smoke to leave the controller of somebody's car out there, or worse. Keep an eye out for it as we wind down with just four laps to go. And after this, right after this, the, the fast nine will wind up, and we'll have an all-out battle. Our top fastest nine cars will be racing just after this. Iron Rose and Lotusaurus Rex exchanging shaking fists with each other. Three laps to go now for Lotusaurus Rex from Milwaukee Makerspace. Get your last moxie points in. Get them in now for these teams. You got all hands active still going out there. Make sure that Moxie Bar gets around to everybody in the crowd. We got Tech Shop Batman still putting laps down. Those pink tires are actually still holding. And Fubo Labs from New Jersey with the solid second place locked in right about now. Unless something happens, more standing. Last lap, last lap, white flag, white flag. That's right. Fubo Labs taking the white flag for second place. Lotusaurus Rex lanes around the Maki Makerspace. All she has to do is keep it together for these last couple turns. Here she comes down the stretch. She goes the road. And the road across. Andre, Lotusaurus Rex wins. Now Matilda, come on, hands active. Surfing away. And Fubo Labs with a second place. From two more rounds all the way from New Jersey. Third place, Patrick. Uh, third place was the Batmobile. The Batmobile. Fourth was Iron Rose. Lucky 13 was fifth. Matilda was sixth. And Vendicart seventh. And Lee, which we only saw two laps of. Same and eight. <laughs>